Hey everybody, it's Callie, your Sensi Independent Consultant, and today we're gonna to do some first sniffs of several brand new bars here for March 2021. Uh, you can still get these in one form or another, so we're gonna do some of the fragrance notes so that you can see what's there. So the first one we're gonna talk about is the new Moana bar. Now this collection launched last week along with Pua the Pig, the Scent Buddy. Um, Pua the Pig you, is sold out, but you can pre-order for the next batch. And this bar just recently sold out too, but you can still add this into your Scentsy Club. So I would add this into your club now, maybe add one, two bars or so, um, especially if you like fruity florals, because this is gonna be a fruity floral. And then if you don't like it, then you can always remove it, but that way you can try it. And if you do like it, as long as it's in your club, Scentsy will keep making it for you forever and ever, even if it retires. So, here we go. I read the fragrance notes, but... Oh yeah. Oh yeah, fruity floral it is. Okay, Sensi says, watering melon, pineapple, and plumeria depict a lush island paradise rich with tradition. I can definitely smell the watermelon and the floral note in this one. Mm, I like that. The pineapple, or maybe it's the watermelon, give it kind of like a tart sweet. I really like that. I hope it's a good performer. I'll have to to warm it so I can see how much it lingers. Yum. Okay, so again, Scentsy Club is the only way you can get this now, so go ahead and add her now. The next one, it's actually a pack of five. This is the new Life's Garden. Now I got this in the whole kit with the bag, and the whole kit with the bag was $28. Um, but you can still buy these bars individually. So the bag is out of stock, but you can still buy the bars individually and you can put the bars individually into your club. So you could do like a six pack bundle and basically get one free or bundle these and add these into packs with fragrances that are unrelated to this. So we're gonna start at the top of my pile. This is apple parsley. So this entire collection is mixed with, is mixed with a fruit and some sort of an herb. And this is like a really kind of a neat green wax. Okay, let me find the fragrance notes. So I know what I'm talking about here. Apple parsley. Okay, first sniff. I haven't even opened these ones yet. Oh, interesting. Apple parsley. I don't hate it. It's definitely, I don't know, it's, it's earthy. But not, okay, it's fresh picked parsley, brings a subtle crispness to tart apple and a luscious layer of juicy pear. Definitely more fruit than like herbal. Oh, that's interesting. That's hard to explain. Fresh picked parsley brings a subtle Christmas crispness to tart apple and a luscious layer of juicy pear. I like it. Hmm, I wonder how it's gonna be an orange. Okay, so here's another thing. Instead of just smelling the top, you can pop your bar out. Okay, on the bottom I smell more of like the like the parsley. Which I don't cook, so I'm assuming that's what parsley smells like. That's interesting. I'm actually excited to warm this one. I do like do like apples. All right, so that is apple parsley. Exciting. Okay, next one is chamomile daisy. I'm actually excited to try this one, mostly because I like the smell of daisies. I think chamomile must be a pretty good scent in itself. Let's get the fragrance notes up. Chamomile daisy. Oh, wrong one. That was the next one. Okay, chamomile daisy. First sniff. Oh, yum. It's like, it smells almost lemony. Okay, it says, bright lemon zest, okay, warms to a tranquil tea-inspired blend of chamomile, flowers, and fresh picked daisy. I like this one. This one, it reminds me like of a tea. Like lemon tea with chamomile, that's what it smells like. So if you liked uh, like the sweet southern tea or if you like some of the other tea kind of fragrances that we've had in the past, you might like this one. It's a very bright lemon tea flavored scent. I like that one. I'm excited. Actually, you know what? Let me smell the bottom of it too, see if I can smell more of the daisy. God, this, this is good. The more I smell it, the more perfumey it gets. And I like perfume. Yeah, I can smell a little bit more of the floral when I smell the bottom of the bar. Yeah, oh, I'm excited about that one. Chamomile daisy. Okay. Chamomile daisy for the win. Next up, let's see what's in my bag. Look, this is like a magic hat. Lavender violet. Lavender violet. So I would assume this one's gonna be very more floral than the other. Let's see. Okay, let's see. Let's see if there's any fruit in this at all. I don't know. Ooh. It's like powdery. It says a swirl of sweet spun sugar. Ah, takes garden grown lavender and violet to alluring marshmallow depths. 
That's why I like it. It's sugar. Yeah, that marshmallow. Oh my gosh, you guys. It's like marshmallow and lavender. And there I can smell more of the violet. This is good. You guys, I'm not usually a huge lavender fan. And I don't mind lilacs, but... Okay, the sugar in this. Oh, yum. Okay, this, so this collection is nothing like I thought. I thought I was going to hate this collection. I'm not a gardener, but boy. This is like a sweet perfume, lavender perfume. Yum. Oh, lavender lovers, here you go. Sweet lavender lovers, here you go. Okay, we're three for three. That never happens in a collection, ever. All right, next one's pineapple mint. Pineapple mint. We just got uh, the sugar berry or the pink sugar berry mint, and that one's a winner. I mean, that's, it just smells so clean. So I'm excited to smell this one. Uh, pineapple mint, okay, I'm not even look at the things. Ready? Ooh. God, what does this smell like? You can tell something's in there other than the pineapple. It smells like a gum. Um, like, like, like a bubblicious pineapple gum is what it smells like. Okay, since he says, juicy pineapple, fresh orange, and refreshing spearmint. There you go. Offer a crisp twist on tropical. That's why it's the spearmint in it. It's like, yeah, it's like pineapple gum. Cool. I don't know that, I mean, I like the smell of it. I just don't know that I want it, you know, warming in my house, but maybe, maybe this will be a really nice one, like when it's really hot and humid. So we'll have to try that. This would be really good in like a cleaning product. Like I really love squeeze the day and just, well, pretty much everything, but yeah, I would love this in a cleaning product. I would eat this in, in gum too, but okay. Interesting, pineapple mint. It smells good, I just don't know if I want it in a, in a wax fragrance, but other things I would 100% get that. Last one is strawberry basil. Strawberry basil. Since you say, well, I won't tell you what since he says, but I'll have it ready, here we go. I love strawberry. Ooh. Definitely hit the strawberry first. On me. Oh, God, what does this smell like? They are so unique, you guys. This smells like another, like, kind of like a gum that you would eat, but but there's no mint in it. Like a ruby red strawberry gum. That's what that smells like. Sensi says, fresh green basil garnishes strawberry and raspberry for a dreamy on the vine vibe. God, they're all good. This smells a little bit lighter than the other four, though. So we'll see how this one performs, but... Oh, I'm excited. Guys, that's that's five for five with this entire collection. I And I thought I was going to absolutely hate this. I'm like, how are you going to mix a bunch of herbs and fruit together and make it smell good? But yeah. So recap is chamomile daisy, pineapple mint, apple parsley, I'm excited about this, strawberry basil, and lavender violet. Okay. I'm a sweet, fruity, um, I love vanillas kind of a girl, and I am loving this collection. So I will be excited to warm this. I'm probably gonna put another order in already for a couple of more, like probably bundle some six packs together because I really like it that much. And I think these are gonna be pretty hot sellers. You might not like everything in the collection, but you're for sure gonna like something, two, three of them. Like this whole collection is good. Again, I think strawberry, um, basil might be the lightest one out of the pack. And I don't know that pineapple mint would be one that I would warm everywhere. Although I do like, love squeeze the day, especially when it's hot and humid out, but everything else I would warm. Like, it's, oh yeah, okay. Like this gets, gets Callie's 100% vote. Like I didn't hate anything in there. That's exciting. Okay, last one, and this one 100% I already love. Uh, reminds me of Pick For You from the Mother's Day collection back in 2020, and this is Plumeria Peach. Fruity floral all the way, I absolutely love it. Oh, and it is a good performer. It's just as good a performer as Pick For You was. I still have two bars of it left, I've been hoarding, but I feel confident now that I get to warm through those, okay? So Sensi says, oh, love it, musk. Oh, not by light, wrong one. Ripe pineapple and luscious peach blend sweetly over a bed of blooming plumeria. 
So you can get like a similarity between this and the Moana one, but they are very different. That one's watermelon, this one's peach. So if you love any kind of fruity florals with Plumeria, pick them both up. They're awesome. Oh, I'm so excited. So I will be making samples of these soon and giving it out to all my VIPs. So, all right. That one again isn't available until April along with the brand new warmer. Life is beautiful. Now this, this wording on here is actually neon. So once you plug it in and turn it on, then the words start to appear like a neon light and it is an element warmer. So it doesn't take a bulb. So your, your warmer is going to be $63. It says it's an elegant floral pattern accented with neon style lighting. Okay. So Pumeri peach will be available in bars. It'll be available in scent circles and also a room spray. Okay. I hope that uh, helped you guys out. I mean, I think I loved every single one of those bars and usually I can give you guys my opinion like, eh, this isn't so hot, but I, I can't even say that anyone are going to be bad sellers. So pick them all up. You can get the Moana bar in your Scentsy Club. You can still pick up Life's a Garden in, um, in the catalog. You can also bundle if they go out of stock. Your backup is your Scentsy Club, so you can add them and keep them forever, ever. And then Plumeria Peach will be available here in April. Or you can come contact me because I have several bars. Uh, we got a few extra of being a consultant, so you can get a little bit of a head start in trying them out. If you have any questions, um, I'm, I'm here for you guys. I hope you have a good day, do great things, and make good choices, and have a wonderful rest of your March. Bye. Mm -hmm.